All right, guys, something about the clock is you want to make sure that you have it set before you get started with the workout. You don't want to have everybody in position and they're waiting on you and you're fumbling around with the remote. So make sure that you know how to use that. Practice it if you don't know how. But here are a couple tips and some things that you can utilize to uh, just to make your life easier and to streamline the workouts a little bit better. So FGB, when you hit that, it is a workout where you have basically five stations. Each station lasts a minute and there's three rounds. So that's why there's 17 minutes. So this will go and it'll start counting down from 17 uh, and each minute it will beep and that's your signal to rotate the stations and at, when i think when you get to minute number 12 it, it'll put an r up there and you'll rest a minute and then you restart your second round right and it goes for three rounds it's five stations it's always set up on that you can't really change that it's always the three rounds of five stations so uh so that that's something that we're going to be using in the workouts Another thing you can use, if you're just trying to set up a interval, like 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, what you're going to do is hit this work button, and then you're gonna see H1, and then whatever the number is. Now, if you wanna set that to a different time, like let's say 30, 30, you'd hit set, you'd hit three, uh, zero, and then hit set again, and then it would be still, the initial time you hit set is gonna be blinking, right? So that's when you hit set, it blinks, and then I'm gonna keep it at 40, so I'm gonna hit four, zero, and then set, and then boom, it stopped blinking. And then, so that's your, your work period, then you hit your rest period. And then I'm gonna have that at 20, that's already set up. How you start that is this bottom right button, and that's continuous. So that's gonna be C1, which means continuous, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off. And that's starting in three, two, one, boom. And then you got 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds rest, and that R is gonna pop up. So that's how you set up the, the intervals. Now, a Tabata, which is something you're gonna use, it's already set up there pretty quickly for 2010s, is Tabata, and then hit the start button. Um, if you're doing an AMRAP, or you just, uh, then you put up or down, if you wanted to count up or down. And the other thing you can do, if you just need a quick stopwatch, like let's say people were on the, uh, they're just doing something quick, and you don't wanna mess with the timer stuff, you just need the, the time going, you hit chrono, and then hit start, and then boom, that is just a stopwatch, it just goes right then and there, and you don't have to set anything up. So wanted you to get familiar with, uh, with those clock usages just to streamline the workouts, practice those, make sure you set up your time before the workout starts, and I will see you soon.